My name is Tracy Longmuir. My business is Isis Pet Care Limited and we look after everybody's pets um, from dog walking, pet sitting, boarding through to doggy daycare. Our turnover is uh, just coming up to the VAT threshold this month, which will be about 76 to 78,000. I was inspired to set up my own business through wanting a change in lifestyle um, and my work-life balance wasn't very good in my old career. So I picked what I loved, which was dogs, and something that I knew really well, which was dog walking and sitting. Without the apprenticeship funding, I don't think we'd have been able to take on as many new staff as we have done. Um, we've had to staff the daycare centre up a lot quicker than I'd planned, and without them, um, we wouldn't have been able to do that. It has worked really well because I now have quite a strong team around me which can plug in the gaps as and when I need to look after my little boy. The Lincolnshire Chamber of Commerce have supported me by putting out the adverts on the internet in the first place for the staff that I was looking for. They interviewed all of the staff um, first and shortlisted them all for me. So all I had to do was turn up and pick one. The small business rate relief is really valuable because it means that we can focus in other areas. So we can focus on things like our uniform and our training and products for our new pet shop. And the most important thing I'm finding now in my experience that the government can do to help me is to look at how the VAT registration affects such a small business like myself. It will stop the customer spending if I put 10 or 20% on their costs. If you hit the VAT in your first year of growth, I would think that it would be fairer and give us a bit of a chance to get on an even keel to introduce it the following year or in a staged implementation.